Hi, my name is Yehuda Avraham and I'm the Director of Development at Bet Uri in Afula. Let me tell you a little bit about Bet Uri and the very exciting Snoozeland project that we would love to build together with you. Let me give you a little background on this incredible residential and educational facility in the north of Israel. Bet Uri was founded in 1969 by the late Devorah Sheik, a Holocaust survivor and visionary in memory of her own son with disabilities. Bet Uri is located in Israel's northern Jezreel Valley in a unique village that is a home to over 100 children, youth and adults with a wide range of disabilities and another 100 staff members who work in the community. Based on the anthroposophic philosophy of Rudolf Steiner, the Bet Uri approach to care reflects this philosophy that emphasizes the impact that a warm, nurturing, and creative environment can have on the individual, no matter his or her abilities. Residents of all abilities, sensory and behavioral challenges, cognitive and physical disability, as well as those with autistic spectrum disorder, all thrive beautifully thanks to the education, attention, and varied activities provided in the village. The green, spacious setting of Beturi as residential buildings, a school for ages 6 to 21, employed in settings that includes craft works and also on-site bakery and cafe gallery that are both for the greater community. But there's something missing, a snoozeland. So what is a snoozeland? A snoozeland is a multi-sensory room with options for focusing attention on certain senses and neutralizing other stimuli, creating a balance between activity and calm. This stimulates reactions and encourages communication, behavioral regulation, and improved functional skill levels. The room is designed to provide stimuli to various senses using sound, music, scents, textures, lighting effects, color, and so on. The walls and floors are padded to allow a child or adult to safely and independently explore the environment. Some of the snoozeland equipment include shimmering, shimmering curtain of fiber optics, a projector that creates color and gentle patterns on the wall and floors, a musical water bed that adapts to the body shape, giving warmth, comfort, and muffled noise. A floor-to-ceiling bubble tube that offers visual, audible, and tactical stimulation. A sensory corner with the fiber optics and switches. A talking cubes to encourage physical movement. The dark, quiet room has bright lights that can be activated through various technologies and the therapy used in the snoozeland does not rely on verbal communication, making it accessible for everyone. Beit Uri serves a population that is extremely varied, both in ages and in type and severity of disability. We have both children and adults with vision impairment and blindness, autism, cognitive disability, many with behavioral and emotional challenges, as well as sensory regulations. One of the most well-known and effective treatments for people of all ages with these diagnoses is a snoozeland room. What will the impact of the project be? We believe that the snoozeland project, project will significantly impact the Bet Uri residents, the children attending the Bet Uri school, and even the staff. The snoozeland offers a space in which to feel calm and safe and reduce distraction so that person is more able to focus, regulate their behavior and their senses. This promotes learning and development. The staff also find the snoozeland extremely helpful in providing a space to recharge with a meaningful break from their daily challenges of working with children and adults with significant disabilities. In order to create the snoozeland, we need your support. So far, we have received a commitment of a partial funding from a Swiss foundation and have applied to the Breakaway Charity in the UK for this project. 
How important is this project to Bet Uri? Really important. We believe that the Snuzan project is a much needed addition to the Bet Uri campus, in keeping with its commitment to the emotional, sensory, and educational needs of its residents and pupils with disabilities. There's a large room available on the Beturi campus that the therapeutic staff and administration believe should be converted into a snoozen in order to expand the range of therapeutic services that is offered to the residents and pupils. If we do not receive funding from the Rogo Fund, we will have to continue to seek funding from other sources, delaying the process of creating the snoozen and providing Bet-Uri residents and pupils with this amazing multi-sensory room and all the benefits we expect them to get out of it. Alternatively, we might have to consider a smaller space with less pieces of equipment and on a smaller scale overall. I'd like to take a moment to tell you about the wonderful impact of the RoboFund grant for 2023 which went towards horseback riding therapy for 11 school children with disabilities at the Bet Uri School. The pupils went once a week during the 2023 school year to the Nira Emek Therapeutic Horse Riding Center in Afula, where they gained important physical strength, coordination, emotional resilience, sensitivity, understanding, and openness to animal, and much more. Unfortunately, after October 7th and during the early weeks of the Gaza War, the therapy sessions were briefly discontinued since there was no bomb shelter on the premises and the overall tense atmosphere all around made it impossible to continue. However, by mid-November, the therapy sessions resumed and the program was completed in full. The pupils reported that they had greatly enjoyed the horseback riding therapy sessions and the therapists were pleased with the progress each participant had made during the year. We are grateful to the Rago Fund for helping us make the horseback riding therapy possible for these Bet Uri school children with disabilities and we hope you will continue to partner with us to work together to improve the quality of life for Bet Uri's very special population of children and adults with disabilities. Thank you.